Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and I've got another collection to finish up for you guys, uh, so I can show you the stats on him. Um, not Elite, Legendary. Also, they released two new legends, Walter Jones and Namdi Asimwa. Uh, definitely going to get him. I'm happy I held off, because that's the corner I'm going to get. Um, his collectibles, I could buy them out for about 450k, which a little high. I could have gotten them earlier for about 350, 315, but... Yeah, I, I can hold out. So I pulled in all. I pulled a couple of packs um, and got the All Pro Vince Wolfort collection. Which then I decided I would do his collection. Um, I don't think I'm gonna keep the card. Actually, I do want the card, but uh, he's worth a decent chunk. So I think I'm just gonna try to sell him. Um, I haven't been playing that many games anyway, so it's not a big deal. But there he is done. And I don't know. I still have that issue with the pictures not loading. It loads for some, like as you can see. But it's not loading for the majority. See, like Walter Payton, Joe Montana, Elway, Deacon, Franco. It loads for a decent amount of them, but I don't know why. Like, it doesn't load for John Randall. I don't know. It's, like, glitched up. I don't know. If you know how to fix that, let me know. It'd be really helpful. Uh, but there's Big Vince. Uh, 20, Madden 25 Team Edition uh, for 2011. So I wish he was a uh, uh, man defense and I would keep him. I'd be more apt to keep him. Let's see here. Uh, da -da. We'll put him in for McCoy for now. Let's see here. D tackle. So let's go over here. 61 speed, 95 strength, 93 awareness. William Perry's got 99 trucking. Uh. see here 63 jump he can throw the ball big wins can throw the ball 93 tackle 64 hit fire 94 power 60 finesse 96 block shed 88 pursuit 93 play wreck so he's got the he's got good stats uh he's got the stats of a d tackle pretty much pretty darn good i don't know i'm considering keeping him uh but i'm not entirely sure what i want to do I'll show you why um, why I'm considering because on my auctions I'm attempting to sell the Brian my Brian Dawkins and also my Randy Moss uh, just because it's not that I don't like them it's just that I don't know if I could get 450k out of Randy and 350 out of Brian Dawkins I would take that all day every day because uh, what that put me that put me well over a million coins that put me lot like. Uh, put you at like 1.2 or something like that mil. Uh, so I definitely take that, but I'm not going to hold my breath. I'm not going to expect it to happen. Uh, but anything's possible, and I would be extremely happy if it did. But I'm going to try to sell the Will Fork as well. I'm going to put him up for 200k because that is how much. He's going for like 250. There's only one up, but I, I highly doubt he'll sell for this much. But I might as well try. Uh, it cost me... If you want to actually do the Vince collection on the Xbox One, it's about I think it's about 150, 140 k to complete. The first three collectibles are all like 15 k each, um, and then one's about 40, and then one's about 50. So it's about 125, 130 k. Uh, so if I could actually sell this for 200, I'd make a little bit of profit. Um, Probably would have been easier just to sell the one collectible. Also have some other collectibles hanging out on my trade block. Uh, I've got Sharp, uh, Chris Carter, and an Olin Krutz collectible. I don't know what I want to do with those. Uh, for now, they're just kind of hanging out, doing absolutely nothing. But I don't know. I'll figure out something to do with them. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop me a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. And let me know what you guys think I should do with Vince Wolfork. And I will catch you guys later. Peace out.